that's jammed with gunners like me, afraid of coming in last. Well, good morning, Houston. Thank you for that uh, great uh, rendition of Days Go By by uh, Keith Urban. Uh, things still need to go by, so uh, we better start living, and we are. We're uh, enjoying every minute up here, and uh, thanks so much for the greetings from the Johnson Station, our home, uh, home with some of the hardest working, most talented people who uh, have made some incredible things happen in space flight. Uh, we thank you for uh, that greeting, and we're looking forward to another great day in space. Just floating through the uh, through the airlock, gets a little noisier in here. Now we uh, we pitch up 90 degrees. That's the back uh, back of the airlock, where when you uh, you do a spacewalk out of the shuttle, that's where you get out into the payload bay. There we are making our way up into uh, what's called the PMA. tight clearances in some of these areas. That's probably the tightest one right there. Okay, and we emerge into uh, into the node, node one. Now, first we're going to look down. We're going to look down into the MPLM. Now, MPLM work is kind of underway. One thing I find quickly is you have to orient yourself in each module. So down to me in this module is like this. This is down. And the reason we call this down is because when we land, it's going to be this side that faces Earth. So when we think about how we pack things, especially water, uh, we pack it so that it'll be lying on something flat uh, when we come back. And we don't pack it on something sharp so that when we come back into the atmosphere and we get back into a gravitational field, it falls onto something sharp and pops. Now we're going to turn you around. Take a look back. We'll head out of the MPLM now. Now we'll hang a right turn, but what we have to do is orient ourselves to down in the space station, which is this way. So that's the direction we were initially facing when we came into space station, but we're not going to go that way yet because there's a couple other things to look at here. And the first one is this way. This is the Japanese module, and it is always the quietest and cleanest place on the space station. We have all of our press events right there, which is why that camera's hanging up there. And we're just going to float through here, and I'm going to show you one more thing that I guess you could call an attic. to pitch up here and we look into what's called the JLP or the attic and that is very very clean too. Houston station on the big loop this is Mike. Burr. I'll go back down there's a couple windows here that we could look out. We we'll look out one of them right yeah, now. How's that for a winner uh, of a download, view? They are downloaded and then let the uh, JSC Photo TV guys know that we've sent those down. It's a beautiful place from up here. Copy out. We'll make that happen. Great. Thanks. All right. We're going to close this window up again. It's a little shutter. It's a wheel just off to my left that I'm turning. And we're going to turn back around. And we're going to head out of the gym. Now, 
Now we're coming up on that node I mentioned. And on the other side of the node is the Columbus module. We'll just take a quick, quick look inside there. You can see here it's uh, it's crowded like everything else. These uh, resupply flights, as they call them, are very uh, disturbing. Is probably a good word when it comes to just overall station organization. So now we're headed back in our original direction. There's Mike Fossum. He's uh, one of the guys who lives here. So he's, I guess, our host. Say hi, Mike. Hi. What did you fly about? <laughs> well, actually, I think I said the last one was node one. That was actually node two back there. Here is node one. And uh, what I'm going to do is pitch down here. We're going to take a look into what used to be an MPLM. It's now called a PMM permanent logistics module and uh, I'm going to orient myself back to down and I'm going to go through here and show you just what pandemonium is <laughs> ensues here because we're moving everything in so you can see it, uh, it just looks like a wreck but it'll look a little bit better before we leave I'd like to uh, thank the commander of the International uh, Space Station, Andre Borisenko, for your hospitality. You've been absolutely fantastic to us. Uh, you and your crew have, uh, have demonstrated not only uh, ISS hospitality, but you've demonstrated fantastic Russian hospitality. It's been wonderful to be here with you. You have a wonderful home. You're taking fantastic care of it, and uh, you are, you're going to keep it uh, looking good for generations of space travelers to come. We have uh, good uh, together work, and uh, I would uh, say you uh, have a good landing. Thank for our work. Anything else we got to do? Just to just say I'm going to say a few words. Oh, yeah. yeah. Right. Hey, just a few words uh, overall on the, uh, the mission itself. Uh, you know, this was a, a little bit of a unique mission uh, for a couple of different reasons. Uh, first of all, we had uh, kind of an abbreviated crew. We had uh, four shuttle crew coming up, joining six space station crew. Uh, I think in this particular instance, it uh, forced us all to work as a, as a, a very tight uh, team from the very beginning. Uh, we had a lot of help from our station counterparts, uh, uh, Sasha and uh, Andre, Sergey. Uh, the very first day that we were uh, docked, they showed up in the MPLM put me to work. Uh, they were absolutely wonderful. They were uh, great sports and uh, took care of uh, actually stowing an awful lot of our cargo for us. Um, we, uh, we emptied the MPLM uh, finally today and uh, just a short while ago uh, put it back in the shuttle's payload bay, uh, hopefully with everything that should be on there and if not what's remaining is going to go through this hatch in just a moment. But uh, to the Expedition uh, 28 crew, again thank you very much for your hospitality uh, on behalf of the 135 crew. Well, thanks, Bergy. It's been a, an honor uh, having you guys on board. It's been great having you guys on board. Uh, it's great being a part of this really important and uh, historic mission. And uh, uh, we want to just thank you guys so much for leaving the space station uh, in, in a posture for, for continued utilization, continued use for the rest of the decade. It's been, it's been really great. And, uh, you know, I'd like to thank Doug for all your work uh, on the transfer and the robotics. It was just amazing. And uh, where's Rex? Rex, thank you for, for all your, your leadership and your dedication and hard work on the uh, spacewalk. Uh, you and the EVA team on the ground really made that, that a big success. And Fergie, thank you for your leadership. Thank you for bringing the guys here. But of, of all your many, many accomplishments that you did on this mission, for us, from our perspective, the most important thing you did was bring Sandy here. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, Sa Sandy, we cannot thank you enough for always keeping the big picture in mind, always keeping what life is going to be like after you guys leave. Uh, you were just absolutely amazing. We just cannot thank you enough for, for everything that you've done for us. And, you know, we don't even realize it yet, but in a couple of weeks, we're going to be going, wow, I'm glad Sandy was here. And we tried to tra trade Mike for Sandy, but Fergie wouldn't take us up on the <laughs> <laughs> But 
Fergie, thank you and your crew so much. Um, like I said, uh, it, it's you really left it in a good position. So on behalf of the Expedition 28 crew, the entire ISS program, we'd like to thank you, your crew, and the entire STS-135 team for leaving the station ready to go for the rest of the decade. So thank you very much. All right. It's our honor. All right. Congratulations. Mike? Uh, right, pod time! Pod time! Thank you. Thank you. See you that was very nice. Oh, no, it was. Very, good. Oh, very good. Oh, very good. Oh, Sasha! Commander. 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 Oh. Commander. <laughs> Andre. Good luck. All right. Good luck to you. See you, Michael. See you, man. Oh. All right. All right. Sergey, you're going to send me a day ago. I know. It's good. Good to see you. Good to see you. Yes, I will have a safe landing. Sasha. Thank you. Oh. Good to see you. You take care. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I see you.